safety. We also are learning more about how 16 year old Ryan Roberts was found dead 24 hours ago. And today, Ryan's mother talked to us about how her son lost his life. Channel 2's Jake Reiner joins us live from the family's apartment complex. And, Jake, what did the mother have to say about this? Well, she did respond to these reports, and she says she doesn't buy it, this satanic ritual that has, a lot of people have been reporting. But police say they do have a person of interest, no one in custody at this point, and they did confirm to us that Ryan died because of multiple stab wounds. Visiting her, and he was A little more than 24 hours after her son was found dead, Christina Roberts tells us she simply doesn't buy it. That her son was killed as part of some sort of devil worship ritual. I know he does not believe in God, but it was not a satanic ritual. He killed my child out of pure anger. If you did it once, you could do it again. Behind this staircase of this southeast Houston apartment complex is the man who was the key to finding Ryan Roberts' body. He brought me outside. He was like, he told me to stay right there. He was like, I hid the body by a pole. Just a few minutes away, Roberts was found yesterday morning near the train tracks close to the South Loop overpass, right where this neighbor's good friend told him it was. I was like, like you, I bet not say nothing, like, like he's going to do something to me. So for the last few days, I couldn't sleep enough for it. Like, I've been like, dang, nervous about it. It came to a point Monday night where this man said he couldn't take the pressure and told Roberts' mother exactly what happened. I kept saying, like, like he wasn't himself, like, kept saying, he sold his soul, like, he was like telling me some crazy stuff, like, stuff that didn't even make sense. As for Christina Roberts, right now she says all she wants is justice. Nobody deserved to die the way my child died. My child did not deserve to lose his life like this. Details are still up in the air as to how Ryan Roberts died, but as we mentioned, police do not have a suspect arrested in this case yet. Coming up at 6, Christina Roberts tells us about the moment her son's friend's mother pays her a visit. For now, we're live in Southeast Houston. Jake Reiner, KPRC, Channel 2 News. Jake